Whenever I see a whiny kid, the Holy Ghost says to me, someone didn't drink their cocoa powder. And whenever I see Donald grump, I get the same thing. In fact, basically every grumpy, negative, pessimistic human didn't drink their cocoa powder today. Their God food. It's that simple. It's actually that simple. Um, your children don't have to be whiny and unhappy. You have to feed them God food. And then they'll feel like paradise and perform like angels. It's actually true. And there's a reason why. It's because it opens up and relaxes their entire blood flow network, which is what they've always wanted in life. And so now they feel like bliss, plus they have the right amount of energy. And so they feel like paradise and they behave like paradise all day long. Wow. And it's free of charge for everyone to do, including Donald Grump who's currently, you know, very grumpy all the time. It's because he doesn't eat his God food every day, like I'm telling people to do, okay? So it's that simple, okay? I, I see people everywhere grumpy, exhibiting symptoms of grumpiness, like loud motor vehicles and peeling out and such. The guy didn't drink his God food. It's actually that simple. He's discontent on the inside. He is a malnourished baby, he is broke. Remember, uh, cocoa was money for the ancient Americans. So if you haven't had any cocoa today, or in a week, or in a month, or in a year, you're broke. You're starving. You are a penniless human that has no power to be happy. You, you literally have zero joy compared to me. Because cocoa is money. God food is money. Well, if someone's not drinking their God food, they have no money. They're penniless. So Donald Trump, for example, is basically penniless as far as joy is concerned on the inside. And the same thing is with all grumpy people. <sighs> it's not hard, people. God made it easy, and he put his name on it. It's free for everyone to drink every day, especially first thing in the morning, so that everyone behaves like paradise because everyone feels like paradise to the glory of God who put his name on it, God Food. I am here to tell you the President of the United States does not know what to shove in his mouth. Nor does any Prime Minister on Earth today. And I'm here to educate you all. 